All right, so Yahoo Answers is shutting down and it's a tragedy, really, truly it is. It is a very sad day for the 11 people that still use that website. But I thought I'd journey back to a time where things were much simpler and people knew a hell of a lot less about League of Legends. Also, we're doing a big giveaway that you can find all the details on screen for here. All you gotta do is go down in the description and follow a lot of the YouTubers and stuff like that that you're probably already following anyway. Don't forget as well to check out my clothing line, Psycho Apparel, for some sick merch. So let's get into things. Like the video, give me a comment for the algorithm, and we don't like to ask for subscriptions here. Instead, we compete for them in rock, paper, scissors, and if you lose, you have to subscribe to the channel. So here we go. Three, two, one. You just possibly lost to a pre-recorded video. So go on ahead and subscribe and enjoy the video. I tried to look up Yahoo Answers for a League of Legends category and it took me to <laughs> an OP.gg called Yahoo Answers. <laughs> hmm. Any tips for a League of Legends for a beginner? Anything specific to spend the point slash week cash on? Forget what it's called. Also, do you get more than six spells for your champion, the Q, W, E, R, D, F, B stuff, or a choice of different spells? Do you get a choice of different spells if you <laughs> change your character? <laughs> if you change champion, you can get yourself another, another set of spells. As for B, I've never ever in my life seen someone refer to B as a spell, but I, you know what? Sure. Right. This was eight years ago, but Darius was still out. And you can tell that this was a uh, old rise because somebody is suggesting it as a beginner friendly champion. Dota 2 or League of Legends, this ought to be good. I played both games but not long enough to judge which game I should focus on as I am only limited time to play. Which game do you see is more enjoyable and overall better experience in all aspects a MOBA has can offer? On Wait, uh, this is such a stupid <laughs> question. Like, I can't make up my mind, can you please decide for me? I'm expecting a flame war because this was eight, 8 years ago. Both communities suck. But League of Legends is a more simpler game, so logically it's easier to master. Dota 2 is almost the same game as League of Legends, but it's much easier to die slash kill. I was expecting like a flame war, although somebody did say definitely League. What is League of Legends about? It's it's about Demacia versus Noxus. Demacia is supposed to be the good people slash monsters, fighting for honor and whatnot. Noxus is the creepy monster, sad emo type of people slash monsters. So League of Legends was created for them to fight, and yep, that's the story of League of Legends. I don't think that's even like, like, is it even actually true? Like, I mean, like, is it? Is it actually true? I knew the, I knew the Ministry of War, the end, what was it called? Ministry of War or whatever was like, I'm pretty sure that is like not like, yeah, they fight, but like, the Institute of War, that's what I'm talking about. Somebody asking, is League of Legends good? I think League of Legends is a great game, but I am not sure. Can someone help? Here's how you sign up. And then he put his referral code in the, <laughs> in the answer. <laughs> Alrighty. League of Legends is horrid. It's another one of the rebel, anti-World of Warcraft style online games. It's all end pointless for gamers to play over Skype with their buddies. To be frank, Minecraft has more purpose than League of Legends. Yeah, WoW well, was a good game. Just need a new engine to be even better. Eight years ago. I wish I could go back in time and tell this this poor soul. <laughs> Probably one of the best MOBAs there is right now. If you do play it, add me. I wonder if this guy still plays. Oh wait, hold on a minute. This person might actually still play League. I mean, their their thing checks out like eight years ago almost. Season four. Adam. Why would I? What? I'm not gonna add him. What? What am I gonna say? Hey, dude. I saw your Yahoo answers from eight years ago, and I wondered you did offer to play a game. Do, do you mind? <laughs> Now, I'm not doing that. The best game ever. Even girls play now. Ah, yes. Definitely a teenager wrote that answer. <laughs> How to be good at League of Legends. I've just started playing. What's the best way to play the game? Then go through many lol forums and QA and Yahoo. QA and Yahoo. The two resources for getting better at League of Legends. The League of Legends forums and the... Q Yahoo Answers? Let's go. You can never be good at a game because there are a lot of good players out there. But the obvious answer is obvious. Keep practicing. Add the summoner. Twit, twit, twit. 787. He'll show you how it's done. Will he now? Let's see if twit, twit, twit still plays. I think he does. He's, dude, he's still. That timeline links up. The timeline links up. He was playing, he's still playing, he was playing yesterday. 
He's gonna show us how it's done. I'll add him, be like, hello, I am new. I'm not, listen, I'm not. I, <laughs> I am not adding these people and explaining, hey, I saw your summoner name on a Yahoo Answers. And I was looking at it because I was curious what, what it said about League of Legends before the, the whole website shut down. Please, stop. No. Stop encouraging this behavior. Do not. Do it for the content. It's not going to be content. It's just going to be a guy like, what are you talking about? I did that eight years ago. Okay? Eight years! In short, it's a great game. It's one of the biggest games of its genre and it's booming at the moment. They have a great community and have little to no bugs as they have a public beta environment where they release new champions and patches before they are released in the full game to prevent any bugs. League of Legends has millions of players. It has even more players than Minecraft. I love League of Legends. It has, it has so many players, even more than Minecraft. Oh yeah. It has so many more players than Minecraft. You put all the Minecraft players and League of Legends players in a room, make them fight. Oh my god, we would win. It has more subscribers than World of Warcraft has in one month. Heck, my friend quit World of Warcraft to play it for a while. What expansion? Yeah, I don't think he quit for League of Legends. I'll be honest. <laughs> I don't, I'll be honest. I don't think your mate quit World of Warcraft because uh, League of Legends was uh, the game that was uh, to be played there. Halo or League of Legends? Which one would you say is better? My friend and I are having an argument. He is a computer gamer and I am a console gamer. Would you say an apple is better or a croissant? My friend says an apple is better, but he, I don't think he's ever had a croissant, okay? You know? <laughs> They're so totally different that it's not even worth asking. Yeah, that's kind of like what I'm vibing with, dude. <laughs> Which hero to play? Oh, uh, what? What? Eight years ago? Ten years ago? Who is suggesting it, champions? I was thinking something along the lines of Shivana. I did not realize that Shivana was released like ten years ago. Master Yi is an, an incredible AD carry, capable of dissimilating a team. I think my, my man whipped out the thesaurus. Pretty sure he meant, yeah, I think he meant dismantling or decimate or something like that. Warwick, on the other hand, is a great jungler that can stay alive in the toughest of situations with just a few items. Now, I'd like everybody to remember what, does, any, does anybody remember what old Warwick? This, this, this is the man capable of surviving any situation. Look at him go. The little goofy boy. He actually looks like a jungle mob man. Like old Warwick literally looks like, <laughs> like he'd be welcome in like the Wraith camp as like the head, like one of the head like big minions man. <laughs> Being able to do, wait wait for it, is he gonna use it? Yeah just do, do it, being able to do that was the best part. Being able to just immediately go like, it's like when Rockley's fighting Gara and he takes off the uh, he takes off the training weights and then all of a sudden he's just like <laughs> So can someone tell me about League of Legends? I've read forums and stuff, but it's not telling me what I want to know. I want to know if you freely go around killing the monsters and leveling up and doing quests and stuff, or joining parties and hunting together. If this game doesn't feature anything like this, then what do what game does? And I'm not looking for World of Warcraft, I've already got it. I'm looking for something else that is free to play online with other people. Thanks. <laughs> I just wonder how many people like booted up League of Legends for the first time and they're like, Where the fuck are the quests? Where are the quests? Where, who am I supposed to get the root? Wait, where the, where, who's the quest giver? What is this? Who are these people? Why am I permanently in PvP? To get straight to the point, can you suggest me a ranged or even a mage champion who's not too weak and fragile? Even if it's hard to master, I don't care because I'll learn to play with them. Try to get Nidalee. She is so hard to play. Since you gotta throw spears at them and memorize when you got a change in a cougar farm, but the positive part is that she can heal, place almost invisible traps, and can basically destroy them. Anivia. Flash Frost plus Wall plus Ulti plus third skill that you didn't remember the name of. Equals dead! Then get Lux. Traps them in light binding, ulti them if they get away, third skill to blast. He doesn't know any of the third skill, man. He's like, I'm gonna use all these names and then third skill. Third skill to blast an area, second skill to save your life. Good champion. This person, like, is just like, can you tell me what champion? And this guy's given, like, breakdowns of, like, the combos you need to be doing. 
in a Yahoo answer. It's like, all right, so what you want to do, dude? You want to press, you want to press Q, then you want to make. If you press, put in the bunk, you press Q. Then if you want to do more damage, you double distortion in. Then you hit them with that. Then maybe ethereal chains to stun them a little bit, and then you maybe mimic with your Oli onto another ethereal chains to make sure they're stunned for a longer duration. By that time is over, there's a good chance you have your first skill up, so you can Q them again and maybe get the the sigil of silence. It'll proc on the W again, and it'll silence them. Then ignite, and then use your third skill again. Dude, LS is a messiah, dude. Everybody, even even nine years ago, is recommending Annie. <laughs> Annie, Annie, Annie. Like, everybody's recommending Annie, dude. Should I download League of Legends or Lunia? What the f***? What is Lunia? League of Legends. A lot of people ask me to download WoW and also Lunia. I don't know what to download. I can't download them both because my computer can only download one more game. <laughs> Oh my god. Bless. Absolutely bless their souls, man. What are the pros and cons to League of Legends? If you like the game being constantly updated, this is the game for you, a new champion, almost once every two weeks. Content they have contests outside of the game itself. Right now, for example, if you are a good beat maker, slash rapper, slash rock star, slash singer, you can win some great cash and item prizes. You know what? I actually remember that. Uh this this is the competition that he's talking about. That, I actually remember this. By the brush strokes, a bunch of coat throats, five to a lane, and hail Caitlin's gun smoke. I actually remember the words as well. The cons. I have only two cons, and they drive me crazy. The community. Yes, it's like every game. A whole bunch of 12 year olds that get pissed off if you make one mistake. There are mature people that don't give a damn about a game to let you know. They will report you for no reason. Stuff like that. Oh wait, update. This goes back to the updates. Every champion they bring out is completely overpowered because Riot tricks the people that use real money on a game to buy them. When they do, you're not going to last long in a 1v1, maybe even with a defense style champion. Overall, I love the game. If, if you ignore the people that talk trash behind a keyboard and be patient until they nerf, uh, you will have a complete blast. I would recommend this game to anybody. I haven't played, but from a friend who did, his main complaint was the length of the duration of the game and sometimes about people getting angry if you quit in the middle. His complaint was that people were not happy that he quit in the middle of the game. 10 out of 10. If that's the only complaint you've got about a game. <laughs> Did I? This is like a time capsule. What did people 10 years ago think, or 8 years ago think the best champion was? There is no best champion. Uh, it's an incredibly balanced game. <laughs> no single champion is better than another. Don't be such a fanboy. Warlink's blatantly outclassed by other champion, uh, other junglers. Ash, oh wait, no, sorry, he's quoting. He's doing quotes. Uh, Warwick's blatantly outclassed by other junglers. Ash is a joke in any role she plays. There's tons of overpowered and underpowered champions, I'll agree. Compared to most games, LoL was pretty balanced, but not completely so. There's there's a reason some champs are banned on site. Anyways, Riven is a little ridiculous. One of her few one of the few glass cannons that can still be super tanky in a team fight because one of her abilities gives you a shield based on your AD. Amumu is the best jungler in my opinion to have. Later on in the game, he has AOEs that are great in team fights and can also and also has a grab that can make early ganks pretty easy. Not to mention he's one of the tankiest champs in the game. Wait, hold on. Sources, level 30, gold 4 League of Legends player. <laughs> source? Me, buddy. The source is coming straight from the horse's mouth. Top 5 champions in League of Legends. What are your top 5 OP or high damage dealing champions in League of Legends? I'll choose the best answer if I agree it. According to lolking.net, the champion with the highest win rate and is accordingly perceived as OP at the moment are Janna, Ramus, Draven, Wukong, and Amumu all have a higher than 53% win rate. In my opinion, the most OP champion is Draven. He's been OP for a while. It's a shame I don't have enough IP to buy him. And League of Legends giveaway.com has yet to put, is this website still like, active? No. I'd see the, the biggest damage output ADC is Draven and champions that rack havoc are Master Yi, Zed, Katarina, and TF. Jace, Amumu, Thresh, Draven, Brand. I mean, Jace, really? <laughs> Aatrox, hear me out. You see Ignite does not counter him because his passive will revive him and the Ignite debuff will be gone and it won't affect how much he heals reviving. So this is when like Aatrox used to like have a, a revive. Shen, master. Q, HP back all day long in lane. Free shield with W. Reduces damage taken with E taunt. Free shield teleport. Oh, how OP is that? Kazakh's the bug. Oh, I see you're isolated. 
500 damage instantly with Q, bonus damage slash slow and passive, a W that deals damage and, and gives you HP. That either refreshes on kills and assists, an ult that you can upgrade all your other skills, plus gives you stealth. OP! TF card master, spam Q all day with regen from blue card, stun or slow from W card, ult that gives you vision of entire enemy team, which is also free teleport. <laughs> Yahoo answers, rest in peace, dude. I, I very much enjoyed looking through some of the, the time capsule that was old League of Legends. <laughs> oh.